okay, you literally cover Gardens and Roses, Paradise City. So, from what I can glean from this, this, this guy wants to die. Alright, so making this video is going to be a bit problematic for a couple of reasons. Firstly, you're probably going to hear background noise from my uh, family down there. That's the struggles of the YouTube life. But hey, it happens to the best of us. Secondly, this is not a scarf. I hate scarves. This is a t-shirt. So I have to, you know, strangle it around myself to keep it tight. And that's why I look like an absolute turtle with no neck. Because I'm holding it with my shoulders. Because else, I'm just going to fall down. And thirdly, whenever I breathe, it, it, it comes out to my glasses like it, it's annoying and I can't see anything within three seconds of me actually being a normal human being and breathing out. But anyways, I'm sorry, but... You just got clickbaited by a B-Tech Mimulus. Yeah, I just don't want to show my face and I think that's the best way to keep a decent audio quality and not look too stupid and not too, you know... I don't want to show myself that, that's just fucking it, I shouldn't even justify that. Yep, like I was saying, you just got clickbaited by me. Because I'm not actually going to be talking about Pokemon herself. I'm going to be talking about the people who are talking about Pokemon. And I'm going to actually defend her, so that's going to be pretty, pretty interesting to see how that goes. Ooh, looky, there's a bit of a reflection here. Hello. Anyway, so if you haven't been keeping up with YouTube channel recently, Pokemon has not been too nice. Allegedly. She has apparently striked various YouTubers for using her videos even though herself reacts to videos on her live stream to, you know, fill up airtime. But these people who made like 10,000 videos on her, they don't just show multiple videos being striked, they only show one, but like the same between all these YouTubers. I mean, we don't know literally what the video said about her, if it made like additional comments, we don't know what the thumbnail looked like, we don't know anything yet we decide to show it in our video. So what most of these people who are talking about her say is that firstly, yep, she's an hypocrite, like I said, she reacts to videos on her stream, and secondly, she's a thought, Twitch thought, you know, like uh, ST Peach. Find the, the, the like similarities between ST Peach and Pokemon on their live streams, I dare you. Because the reason Pokemon has so much followers is because she's mainly a gamer. She doesn't primarily do whatever ST Peach does. Okay. But because she's a female streamer who happens to, you know, have some questionable moments at times, she's a Twitch star. And that apparently warrants tens of thousands of videos on made on her, like fit completions or whatever. Say, you, 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 wanna, you wanna know something? You know, the videos she actually striked? Well, it was those. You know, you know the Pokemon moaning compilations or whatever? That's the things she's trying to copyright strike. I'm happy to elaborate on my side of the story. The clip that they use about me talking to someone about taking their videos down is a guy who uses my clips and other streamers, sticks them together and throws really bad clickbait slash lies on them to get people to click them. It's not transformative content. I'm well aware of what transformative content is and I take it down because it's within my right to do so. And I do it because if I leave it up, it's harmful to my brand. Things like Pokey kisses X guy or Pokey bends over or really outlandish random stuff He's cleaned up his channel since then, but that was what I was referring to when I was talking to him on stream and he was well aware of it. He's cleaned up his channel since and he has plenty of my content, but I don't take it down because it's not misleading and it's not inappropriate. And I never take down critiques or place false copy strikes on transformative content as you can see by memeology videos still being up, obviously. It honestly really sucks for me that this is how it's all been painted, maybe because of the alinity situation, but I don't do that and I'm always sure to be well within my right. Yeah, I let people use my clips if it's not inappropriate or misleading, slash a lie. Sometimes if it's really popular video, it gets claimed by my MCN, not taken down, but that's because it's still my content and because they uploaded it first, I'm unable to use it and monetize it on my own channel. So it makes sense for my MCN to monetize it, but those are specific cases. I think people underestimate how much I really stand up for transformative content. I really think people should be free to say what they want and would never stand in the way of that. Pokemon reacts to KSI on point, but in the thumbnail, she has a picture of a girl's booty, which isn't even hers, not even her booty, and the title and the captions I can twerk, I can twerk on this. Pokemane Moan Sound Volume 3, 
Pokimane shows ass on stream, not clickbait. Pokimane hot and funny moment. Pokimane accidentally moans very hard on stream. Pokimane fap moaning montage. Whoever's making these, you are some virgin, I tell you that. I, I, I totally forgot about this. I don't have a script for my videos, so I totally forgot about this. But remember when I was talking about that one certain video that all those YouTubers showed? Yeah, well, it wasn't even a copyright strike. Apparently, we're in 2019 and we still don't know the, the, the difference between copyright strike and a copyright claim. So let me sort it out quickly for you. A copyright strike is when the video is taken down due to copyright infringement, actually blocking the video everywhere and resulting in a strike on the uploader's account. Copyright claim is when the under revenue is claimed or when the video is blocked in all countries, but a video is not taken down and a strike is not warranted to the owner's account. Is that clear? Copyright strike bad? Copyright claim? Who cares, mate? Not actually. People who make a living out of videos might actually care about a copyright claim because some of them are quite bullshit. I've, I've had the experience of that on many other YouTube channels. But still, copyright claim is not inherently bad for your channel. It won't result in your channel being taken down. At least I hope so. Because let's be honest, 99% of the people who've made videos on her recently have just seen an opportunity and have decided to take it without doing any research. I mean, you can, I guess you can say that with me, with the Siva Gunner thing. But that's quite different. I wasn't shitting on them. I was actually reporting that termination. So it's not exactly the same thing. Meanwhile, here is, it can just come off as like unwarranted hate. It's just stupid. These videos literally can be resumed by. Hey guys, Unfunny Talentless YouTuber here. Pokemon has not been too nice recently. She's apparently copyright strike to YouTuber. What a hypocrite. She reacts to videos on her stream. So she's a thought be because I'm unfunny. I'll repeat it 10,000 times because it became a meme from PewDiePie. Thought, 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 thought. Number 15. <laughs> Anyways, hope you enjoyed this kind of ranzy, kind of bollocks video. Uh, I have made a run video since like 2017, and that was the actual core of this channel. So if you want runs to come back, or just more ranting videos, more commentary videos, smash that like button. <laughs> Seriously, leave a like on the video, leave a comment saying if you want to see more. I know I look like, a, like an absolute weirdo right now, but I hope you understand that my privacy matters and I don't want to, you know, put like cluster truck gameplay in the background. I hope you understand, but hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Tell me in the comments if you want more. Thank you for watching. It's a zero. And I'm out.